At long last, finally, after two plus years of waiting, we finally have our power wall installed and what a beauty it is. Now, just some background here. We want a few Founders Edition Powerwall 2s from the Tesla referral program. Shout out to all of you that helped make that happen and shout out to Tesla for coming through with the Powerwalls. It's taken over two years, maybe even three years at this point to actually receive them. So I wanted to share some observations for those who may also still be waiting or for those who are interested. For those who don't know, the Tesla Powerwall is its home energy storage product that can do just that. Store energy generated from your solar panels and or the grid and use that energy to power your home on a daily basis during peak hours or solely as a backup power source. Back in 2016, Tesla made the Powerwall one of the prizes that you could win in its referral program. But not just any Powerwall. This was a red Founder Series Powerwall hand autographed by Elon, JB, and Franz. Tesla has been slowly delivering them to customers over time. Emphasis on slowly. Now, to be fair, there were two significant events that have prolonged the delivery of these power walls. The first was just innovation, whereby Tesla made a better power wall known as Powerwall 2, which was more efficient, had a modular design, giving it more versatility and better scalability. The second event was the disaster in Puerto Rico, where Tesla diverted all power wall resources to get people powered down in Puerto Rico. So now that the disaster is over and resources replenished, you may be one of the lucky few that is called to redeem your power wall. Here are some things to consider. Number one, you can't take delivery without installation. These are heavy 250 pound battery packs that require specialized installation and setup. Therefore, if you want to accept this reward, it has to be installed, which the installation is also included on Tesla. Number two, Powerwall prizes can only be installed at a residence where your name is on the electricity bill. So if you want multiple Powerwalls and you want to put them in different locations like us, you won't be able to unless your name is on the electricity bill of the other locations. Even if your name is on the deed of the other locations, if it's not on the electricity bill, Tesla will not be able to install it there. Number three, there is a small processing fee of about $150 to be paid in this process. It's not a big deal at all considering the value of each power wall, but just something to note. Number four, the permit slash approval process can take months. Ours took quite a while to get done. And despite resources being diverted to Puerto Rico and other small delays, the permit process took the longest. At the end of the day, it's going to be up to your individual county or city to determine how quickly the proposed designs from Tesla get passed through. But at the end of the day, you should expect that there's going to be a little bit of a wait. Number five, if you choose not to take delivery of the Powerwall, you can cash in for some Tesla credits. Now, obviously, because this is a, a gift that they're giving you as a result of the referral program, they're not going to be able to give you cash. Otherwise, you have to pay taxes on it. So they can provide you with Tesla credits. However, the value of the Powerwall by Tesla accounting is significantly less than what they charge consumers directly. Now, check this out. On Tesla's website, they charge $7,600 for one Powerwall, right? So that's the base hardware plus the supporting hardware, $7,600 US. However, a Founder Series Powerwall with Elon, JB, and Franz's signatures should be valued a lot higher. However, Tesla's valuing it at $5,500. This is very disappointing. Uh, just surprised that they would be able to value it so low, especially if they're not even going to put it on par with a standard power wall. Uh, basically, you can't buy these founder series power walls. You can't buy them from someone else because they have to be installed by Tesla. You can't buy them from Tesla directly. So they should be valued a lot higher than fifty five hundred dollars. But that's what they're going with. Fifty five hundred dollars is the value if you decide to cash these in for Tesla credits. Very disappointing, but, you know, it is what it is. OK, and number six, lastly, Relocation is not on Tesla. It's its own separate project. If and when you decide to relocate, you'll need to consider the cost of relocating the power wall or power walls, which would also need to go through Tesla for the warranty purposes. So take that into consideration. OK, having said all that, how do we like the power walls? Well, it's awesome. Uh, it's quite frankly, very awesome, non obstructive, doesn't need gas 
and the app is integrated with the app for the cars so we can manage all of our Tesla energy related activity all in one place. The installation once everything was approved went very fast and smoothly minus the fact that they sent a founder series power wall without the signatures, uh, which was a mistake. And they asked if we wanted to keep this one or we wanted to request the other one. Obviously, we want to get the one with the signatures. So we asked them to go pick that one up. They quickly went back to the warehouse, picked it up, brought it back within the same day and proceeded with the installation. So very good for on Tesla in terms of installation. The guys were great giving me insight into the entire process, telling me what they're going to do before they do it and doing it very quickly and very and cleaning up after themselves, which was awesome. Now, I know what you're thinking. In the beginning of this video, didn't he say that he had three power walls coming? Well, yes, we did. Uh, however, this project has taken so long and now we have a whole baby uh, in this world to take care of. And so our circumstances have changed and we're working on a top secret project right now. So I will divulge what happened to the other two in a later video. OK, so let us know in the comments. Do you have a power wall? What do you think about it? How do you like it? Uh, how's it serving you and your purposes? Uh, do you have solar? Do you not have solar if you have a power wall uh, or if you want a power wall? Are you still waiting to receive it or if, have you received it very quickly? OK, so let us know in the comments. Let us know what you think about the power wall. Any questions that you have about the power wall, please feel free to shoot them over to us. We'll be happy to answer them in the comments. Until next time, enjoy your day and enjoy your power wall or Enjoy your Tesla.